Time now for Talking Pictures with Tony. Halloween is tomorrow, and while some people may go out and celebrate, others may want to stay inside. So if you want something scary to watch, our film critic Tony Descano has some spooky suggestions. Good morning. It's Halloween weekend, and I have a few last-minute suggestions for you to watch, beginning with Exhumed, A History of Zombies, hosted by Dr. Emily Zarka. When you hear zombie, do you think of shambling, flesh-eating corpses, or maybe violent, infected humans? I'm Dr. Emily Zarka, and I'm a monster expert. Zombies have been consistent across our culture, pop culture, for hundreds of years now, and I don't see that changing anytime soon. And in modern day, I think it started with really a resurgence in George Romero's Night of the Living Dead. Um, we revisited the zombie lore, and, and he kind of changed what that was. I think. No, I completely agree with you. I like to say that George Romero did for zombies what Bram Stoker did for vampires, right? He took these different ideas about the undead, different mythologies, and combined them into one reanimated corpse. Exhumed, A History of Zombies, is an intriguing and revealing look at why zombies have become entrenched in mainstream America. It's airing on PBS and gets an A. On the Travel Channel, veteran ghost chaser Dave Schrader and his team track down America's most terrifying haunts in the Holzer Files. It's possible that there are multiple bodies. Well, we know it wasn't just on this lot. In this file, I have letters from six other families within a mile radius of this location complaining of the exact same type of phenomena. Wow. Man, I just keep seeing a butcher knife. I'm seeing a knife, a big knife, like. You know, the more I feel into it, too, there might be something like, like, I almost wonder if we're dealing with a serial killer. In the series, Schrader and his paranormal team reopen and investigate Hans Holzer's actual case files, like the Amityville case. I chatted with Dave about the series. What is the biggest misconception that people have about uh, the other world or supernatural events or ghosts? I think, you know, many people immediately go to being terrified. And that's it, right? We're afraid of things we don't understand. On our show, it would be easy to jump to, it's a demon, because it did something unnerving. And understand, sometimes these spirits have been trying to communicate for 40, 50, 60, 100, 200 years, and they finally have somebody there listening. So we try to take it a different way and approach the, the, the investigation in a calming way, although we get unnerved quite often on the episodes because when you're in a dark space and you start to hear something breathing or walking up next to you, it's impossible to not get unnerved. Was that just a scream? Did you hear that? It's what so many people have reported, a scream that came from this area. What is that? Oh, look at that. The Holzer Files is a real life jump scare fest. And if you like to be scared, it's really fun to watch. Again, it's airing on the Travel Channel and gets an A opening in selected theaters and on all video on demand platforms is the horror thriller spell in the film a man crash lands in the backwoods of the appalachians and discovers he and his family are in danger of being used in a sinister ritual hey! this is for your own good again spell is opening in selected theaters and on all video on demand platforms. It gets a B and is rated R. And if you'd like to see Spell in your home for Halloween, we have your chance to win a digital copy. All you have to do is log on to our webpage and follow the instructions. There's a limited supply and winners will be notified by return email. Have a happy Halloween. For ABC4, I'm film critic Tony Toscano. All right, thank you, Tony. Good suggestions. Now, if you like Tony as much as we do, like his Facebook page, Talking Pictures, or just visit his website, talkingpictures.tv.